you guys welcome back to my channel if you're morning. new here good morning if you're new here i'm izzy this is my husband chris which is still a very weird word for me because if you've been following us for a while we only just got married like three months ago but anyways we're back in one of our favorite places this weekend we are in tofino when was the last time we were here last summer yep yeah last summer so like a year and a half ago if you watched that vlog you know how much we love it here but this time around we are staying at mackenzie beach resort it's, we're in like the cutest little, it's one of their modern suites. So I wanted to give you guys a little tour to start off the vlog and then we're gonna hit the beach and check out the surf. Might be, surf might be a bit cold at this time. Yeah, it's, um, it's about seven degrees. It's almost December, so it's gonna be freezing. I, I'm not surfing, I'll tell That's you that right now. All right, here is our little suite. It's so cute. You can tell it's brand new, super modern like appliances, like the lights and stuff, little skateboards on the wall. This bed is so comfy, it's memory foam. And then they just have like cute little thoughtful touches and we have a little kitchen area, a little closet. And then, excuse me please, outside there's like this cute little patio area. It was obviously raining all last night but it's supposed to be nice tonight so I'm hoping we can use this. There's like a little fireplace. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, we have like our whole little there's an outdoor hot shower there too, oh, which yeah. is pretty sweet. Yeah, hopefully, well, Chris will use that after he surfs. And then we have a barbecue and a little cute patio area. It's chilly out there. And then I think the bathroom's my favorite part. There's like the shower's just very aesthetic and the floors are heated, which I love, but isn't it so cute? They have really nice bath and shower products as well, which I'm stoked to use. Chris made coffee with our little, gave us some um, What's this stuff called again? What do you mean? Dehydrated coffee? No, what's it called? No, it's what's just it called? grinded coffee beans. Grinded? <laughs> Ground. <laughs> We're a shit show today. What do you, you couldn't even get it. I know, I said we. No, it's, what is it called? It's not, is it just coffee beans? Yeah, coffee ground grind? coffee beans. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh my god, I'm not okay. <laughs> No, what's the other thing? What's the other kind of coffee that you can buy? Instant. Yeah, it's not instant coffee? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm not okay. Anyways, this is like our favorite brand, you know, <laughs> the Rhino Coffee. We'll probably go there again later this trip and show you guys it because it's super cute. All right, we're putting on the rubber boots to go to the beach. These are my little Uggy ones. I love them. I just got them. They're like fluff on the inside, but you can see them through. They're so cute. This is the main little front desk area that we checked in last night. It's just so cute and very like cozy and I'm excited to explore the rest of the resort because they have a sauna. I told you that, right? So we're gonna go check out. Yeah, just so cute, so cute. That right there is the sun trying to come out. I'm so happy we're gonna get at least one sunny day while we're here because I think it's supposed to rain the rest of the weekend. Okay, we got slightly more civilized dressed and we just arrived at Tacofino, the Tacofino truck, the OG. If you've never been to Tofino before, then you probably don't know that that's here and you need to go there. The tacos here are just like way better than any other Tacofino location because it's the original and we're here right at opening, but there's no line obviously. We're used to standing in like an hour long line and waiting for tacos, but not today. Oh yeah. I ordered my favorite tuna to taco. It's so good and a fish taco. Chris got all the food. What do you mean? I got a crispy chicken burrito and a bar got a burrito and, and a taco. <laughs> the two biggest things on the menu. What do you mean? You got three tacos. He's hangry. Wait until she. Wait and you see how much it is. I bet you it's more food than me. I bet it's not. Fish taco. And then two tuna and a fish. I'll see you later. Thank you. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you want to just put it in mine? parking lot taco, don't mind us. We're starving. Okay, first taco is so good. We're saving the last two for the beach and we're just gonna go quick up, quickly pick up another coffee. And then we're gonna go walk along another beach. 
perfect little spot to eat the rest of our food and drink our drinks. They're from Tafishan, by the way. Really cute little cafe. I got a dirty chai because I've been into those lately. Yeah, and the surf looks good, so Grumpy Gills is coming around. <laughs> it's really nice. It's not too windy, too. Okay, I feel like we're so all over the place today, but like because the surf was so good, Chris decided that he's just gonna get out there and go surf. So we are at the surf shop getting a board for him and a wetsuit now, and he's gonna go hit the water. If you guys watched our last Tofino vlog, you probably remember this cute little surf shop. Long Beach, Long Beach surf shop. That's where we rented last time too. And they have everything. They've got even a roof rack for our, for our Queenie, our car. All right, he's dressed in his seal suit. Just wait till you see the hood. The hood and the gloves and the boots. It's like a full on circus animal. <laughs> we want to see it. Put it on, please. They look really cute. Like a little seal. <laughs> Stunning. He couldn't handle the hood, it was too tight on his big nog. So he ditched it. <laughs> Bye! What? You won't comfy with it all. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Okay, it's actually very warm now. Like I'm not cold at all. I almost need to take my scarf off because it's really warm and nice. I'm so happy that we got such a nice sunny day. I wasn't expecting this at all. Coming this time of the year, like it's our first time coming during like storm season as they call it. So we were just expecting like a cozy rainy weekend. So this is such, such a treat. I'm just hanging out with the world's largest crow I've ever seen in my life. Oh, might even be like a raven actually. It's massive, terrifying. He made it, and he's not an icicle. <laughs> Alive and well. Okay, game plan. The surfboard makes so much noise. <laughs> it's so loud. Fox. Oh. Um, okay, our game plan is we're heading into town. We're gonna go to the grocery store, get some snacks, and the liquor store, and get some alcohol, and go to the beach for the sunset because it's the only nice day. Tomorrow's supposed to be really rainy and gross, so we'll probably be inside, so we're trying to spend as much time outside as we can tonight. That's the plan. And then I don't know what we're doing for dinner. You want to go to the barbecue? Yeah. Like, at our resort, there's there's this, like, barbecue place, and they have this huge smoker we walked by earlier today that's probably really good, so we might do that, or maybe we'll come back into town. TBD. All right, we just got back from the store. We picked up some little goodies to make a charcuterie board. We got this little meat trio, some crackers. This cheese looks really good. It's like a spicy and smoky Monterey Jack. And then this is like a cranberry and cinnamon goat cheese, which sounds good. And then some olives because you can't go wrong with olives. Yum. Mm. Okay, we found our spot. It's very close to where we were this morning when we had our tacos. Chris stopped at the brewery and he got a little beer to have. Four beers. I got some Olays. I've been enjoying these lately and I got us a spicy bean Caesar because duh. And we're just gonna put our little board together. Ooh, stunning. Good pour. <laughs> Ta-da! Our stunning little, let's turn this, it'll look prettier. Love. Okay, we just went and took some photos, which are really cute. I'll try to show them to you on my phone. I didn't vlog while we were taking them, but we came back to our charcuterie board. And Chris was like, where did the meat go? And I was like, no, you're joking. Either a dog or like an absolute crow, like the one that I showed earlier. No meat, not a slice of meat left. <laughs> That's actually so funny. We we made I reckon it was a dog. I reckon we made whoever. Yeah, we made a, the day, whatever it was. Yeah, and there's a dog that lives in the house, like that we're sitting right in front of, and that's probably what it was. His lucky day. Well, why was he barking at us? He should be looking our looking our faces. Okay, I'm trying to show you the photos we just took. Oh my god, there's coffee on my pants. Perfect. Oh, uh, black ones. 
These are the photos that we just took. They're so cute, I think. He was like whipping me around on his back and I, I'm still dizzy, but it was really fun. The sky is turning to turn pink and it's so pretty. We've just been sitting and chatting out here and now it's like <laughs> almost dark. We've been solving all of the world's problems. We're just gonna go for a little walkie walk. The tide is so far out now, so we're gonna go try to catch it. But it's actually it such a pretty sunset. Wait, let me, let me try to show you. Tofino never disappoints, honestly. Okay, we're back at our little hotel room and Chris got the fire started outside so we are gonna enjoy this tonight while it's not raining because it's not covered but our little patio deck area is so cute. We should go see if they have marshmallows. Yeah, we forgot to get some at the grocery store earlier today so we're gonna go see if they have them at the little general store. How cute. Put on an extra cozy sweater and I'm gonna attempt to open this bottle of wine. I'm really bad at this. Chris, you might have to come intervene. What? You might have to intervene here. I'm so bad at this. Yeah. Just so if you need to just be aggressive at the start. Oh! Be aggressive. Be e aggressive. living his best life. <laughs> Shoes off, feet by the fire. Don't in. Oh my God, don't do that. All right, we were just having a debate. So we had to get in the car and drive somewhere because the place on our property was Really close for some reason. We were sad about the that. The BBQ place. The barbecue Disaster. place. Disaster. Yeah, that Chris was really excited about. Anyways, we're <laughs> sometimes <laughs> I ask Chris questions and I'm like, how do you pronounce this? And then I ask him another word and it sounds exactly the same with his Australian accent and it just like gives me joy. So I thought I would share it with you guys. So we were looking at this restaurant called Roar and then the way that he says it, I was like, okay, say it. Roar. So I was like, okay, well, how do you say the word raw? Like a raw bar, like a raw seafood bar. So say, say roar. Roar. And then say raw. Roar. <laughs> so I'm just like, well, how do you differentiate between the two? And I've done this game. It's discriminating against my culture. I know, I am. I'm so Look, sorry. I'm it's the so way I speak, darling. <laughs> I'm very sorry. It's raw. And it's all fucking raw. And it's all raw. <laughs> it gives me joy. I just thought I would share that with <laughs> you. Anyways, so we ended up at Shelter Restaurant instead of the barbecue place because it was open and their food is really good. I ordered like a salmon bowl and Chris got an entire baguette with his seafood chowder. <laughs> Looks so good. Okay, we're back at the hotel. I just dove headfirst into the bed. Um, we picked up some treats. These are the Haribo, they're called Tang Fastics. I love the gummy bears so much, but these ones are like the like sour candy ones. They're so good. And milk duds for old time's so. sake. Chris and I have been really into the show called Bad Sisters on Apple TV Plus, and we are on. We last night we like got here so late because the traffic was nuts. If you've never been to Tofino before, there's like construction on one of the main highways to get here. And they like every hour they like close both directions and like if you don't get there like right on the hour you have to sit there for a full hour until they reopen the road it's so frustrating so last night we got to that spot at we were like rushing to try to get there at 8 got there at 805 they had closed it already so we had to sit there for an hour so it was like so frustrating so anyways it took us an extra hour to get here than normal so that being said, we got here really late, so we just like binged 
two episodes of the show last night when we got here and we have like half of the last episode left we just like couldn't keep our eyes open last night to finish it but yes yeah, so we have like half an episode left bad sisters on apple tv so good so good it got rated 100 percent on rotten tomatoes so we were like yeah we'll watch it and like we love it we're addicted we've been watching like at least one episode per night for the last week so we're about to finish the season good morning you guys we're back at the beach today nice and early so that this man can have a little surfy surf before it starts it's actually not raining right now which is really nice so i can sit on the beach and be dry and the waves are good so everyone's happy everyone's having a great saturday brought my little coffee to the beach again and i'm gonna be his number one fan while he goes out there it's just so beautiful here it's almost like ethereal like even when it's cloudy like this it's always like kind of misty and foggy and it just like doesn't even look real i love it i love it so much I hope it doesn't rain as much as they say it's going to today. Like you can kind of see like the sun is trying to poke out. So maybe we'll get lucky, but we'll see. We've also accepted that maybe it'll be a brewery day today. Here he comes. How was it? I'm freezing. <laughs> okay, we whipped back to the place. Oh, it's raining. We whipped back to our spot to just quickly change. Chris had to change his wetsuit and now we're heading into town. We're gonna drop off the surfboard and we're gonna go get some breakfast because it's almost noon. We haven't eaten anything yet. We're gonna go to Rhino Coffee. Okay, Rhino is so good as always and the owner was in there and I posted a story and tagged Rhino and he came over and said thank you and he was so nice he gave us this like massive swag box with like tons of cool stuff in it it's got coffee a glass mug a travel mug more coffee and yeah, Chris likes that that one and I feel like you'll use this one for work a lot too anyways he really hooked us up and he gave us a gift card so that we can come back tomorrow, which we are very excited about because the food there is so I good. I had a, like a donut like, breakfast sandwich. What was it called? The bro-nut? The bro -nut. And it was next, next level. <laughs> Mine was good too. And I had a donut, obviously, because they have gluten-free sprinkle donuts and it was so good. I'm very full. But yeah, it was delicioso. Next stop, Tofino Brewing Company. And a try all. <laughs> Goods. Okay, we've been here for a little bit longer than we planned, so we ordered some food from the food truck that's out front. This is gluten-free fried chicken. Had to do it. Had to try it. Is it good? Okay, we changed into our puffer jackets and decided it would be fun to go for a walk on the beach with umbrellas. But little did I know that it's like way too windy for an umbrella. It's gonna go inside out in like two seconds. Anyways, so that's what we're doing now. This is officially the worst idea I've ever had. My umbrella just keeps going inside out. Oh! <laughs> Every time we turn around, it just goes inside out. This was Izzy's idea. <laughs> I didn't want any part in this. I, it was not my brightest, all right? Fine. She said it would be lots of fun. It is fun, I'm having fun. Are you having fun? Yes. <laughs> it might be the worst idea I've ever had. Chris just said, it's probably the worst beach conditions he's ever seen in his life. Ever. It's pretty, well, it wasn't like a hurricane or anything, but like. Well, like, I've never been to the beach in a hurricane, so. Neither. That was the worst. Yeah. Well. <laughs> back to the not brewery. Not doing that again. <laughs> okay, we're back at our cozy little abode. Just having a little warm up break and having a little cocktail in our bed. 
Well, we're watching an episode of the show that we started watching last night, which is, um, what's it called? The Morning Show. The Morning Show. Really good cast, Jen Aniston, Reese Witherspoon. First episode last Steve night was Carole. really good. Yeah, and Steve Carell, so. We are watching the next episode, and then we're probably gonna go for dinner. Okay, I just did a quick outfit change after a little relaxing TV watching session. Um, my hair is so gross, it's like full hat head. I'm wearing my tooth all day, but I'm just wearing this little little sweater and my current favorite Abercrombie jeans, and we're gonna go find a spot for dinner. Our dinner spot of choice tonight is 1909 Kitchen. It's supposed to be really good, so we're excited. So far, it looks really cute. I felt like a extra dirty martini, so that's what we're going with. And Chris got a sour, bourbon sour. Okay, to start, we're sharing a pear salad, which looks unreal. Is that mascarpone? Yeah. Oh, stunning. Chris went with a mushroom pizza, fungi pizza. I went with truffled squash risotto. Very, very good. I just had one little bite. Okay, we are back home. I am in bed with my jammies on, and we're going to watch a couple more episodes of The Morning Show. It's so funny, like... I was just thinking about the contrast between like being here in the summer and the winter. Obviously the sun sets like pretty much like f five hours earlier than it does in the summer. So it feels like you don't do as much during the day. I mean, especially when it's raining versus sunny. So that's fine. We uh, were wishing that we had a hot tub today. I think some of the units here at Mackenzie Beach Resort do have like hot tubs on their patio. So next time definitely want to try to snag one of those rooms because we loved our little fireplace last night but it wasn't covered so today when it was raining obviously couldn't have a little fire so hoping for some nice weather tomorrow so we can go to the beach one last time and enjoy what is that marijuana stick <laughs> oh my god you can't your marijuana stick was useless didn't really work. Why? Was it too old? Um, I think so. You don't know? I guess it was too old. Oh. Why are you feeling with me? It didn't work or you didn't get high? It's just like it's because it's so old it just wouldn't even... Hmm. Damn. I mean it lit but it just was like... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. No action. Mm. Good morning you guys. It is Sunday today and sadly it is our last day here so we're just packing up our cozy little spot and then we're gonna go back to Rhino because it is our fave and we have that stunning gift card to use. It is such a nice day outside today and we weren't expecting to see the sun which is such a nice treat after yesterday's <laughs> torrential downpour disaster. So we're definitely gonna go to the beach. trip to Rhino we got a try for the road because we had some extra money left on our little gift card um, I got a tuna bowl this time I haven't eaten it yet I'm saving it because I wasn't starving so I just had my little donut first Chris got the same thing as yesterday because it was money money and he got an apple fritter this time so trying new things and we're just gonna go hang out at the beach for a little bit and kind of soak up this sunshine before we have to head back to Nanaimo to catch the ferry so I had to go back and get another layer so I just look ridiculous but it's fine and warm. So many big muscles and shells with barnacles on them and stuff. It's really cool. Look at all of them. Okay, we just pulled over to get some lunch for Chris. I still have my tuna bowl, but we're at Wildside Grill where we came last time. We were here and their tacos and food is really good too. Okay, we ended up getting a triple threat, which is one of these is fish and one is salmon. And then the other one is carnitas. And I'm gonna have a bite of that one. You're having the carnitas. 
Yeah, I'll have a bite or, or maybe all of it. <laughs> Okay, I want a taste review between this one and the Tacofino. This is the fish one. So that's the same taco that he got the other day. Verdict. Um, can't beat the Tacofino. Really? This is also very good. Okay, okay. I couldn't do a head to head because I didn't have a fish taco today because they're battered. But the Carnitas one is very good very tasty. The only thing about the Tacofino ones is it's harder to make them gluten-free because a lot of the stuff is like marinated in like soy sauce and stuff. So then you don't get the full flavor profile. But honestly, Wild Side, just around the corner from Tacofino, very, the very menu, close second. In how, like, the whole food menu is very good. Yeah, and they've got like burgers and poutine and chowder and right. fish and chips, right. literally mm -hmm. everything. Everything. Just like that, it is time to hit the road. Okay, we made it to the ferry terminal. It's obviously dark outside now. Um, we're about to get on, but thank you for hanging out with us this weekend. Hope you guys enjoyed getting to see Tofino during storm season like we did. Yeah. And if you missed it, we did do a vlog, which I've already mentioned, like, I guess it was two, su no, it was last summer, 2021 summer. We did like a four day trip to Tofino in the summer and it's so so different so if you missed that vlog check it out too if you're ever going to Tofino and like need ideas of stuff to do that one was like very full yeah it's it good. good both very different yeah different but fun definitely pack for cold weather when you come if you're coming in the winter because it's chilly yeah but on the beach the that like the wind the ocean breeze just rips through you yeah it was very cold cold today yeah yeah but anyways um, probably warmer in the water to be honest yeah. With that thick wetty on. I couldn't couldn't confirm that. I did not go in and I was not interested in doing so. But anyways, um, make sure you guys subscribe so you don't miss any other videos. And we will see you soon. Till next time.